tell us about this, uh, Gail? Um, yeah, we've, it's very warm. Um, I think they used to practice a fair bit of rock climbing here. And, um, so yeah, it's very hard to see anything. But um, basically around here they use the red ochre. Yes, I've heard and, of that. Um, I think that... Yeah. Emu. Ah, yes. So it, yes. It, this links in with Black Range and the red ah. oak. Yeah. Like um, emu prints as well as links it in to the Grampians, so it's all ah. to do with the emu and, you know, people are very um, connected with the giant emu story. Yeah, yeah. Know. yeah. Look at that little plant. <laughs> yeah, should, I might know, go take some photos. Some areas are on fire, it's amazing. Like if you go up Bunjil Shelter, um, that's an amazing site too. We've got links there. It's, um, and then because they've had that fire through the the rock, it heats so much in the fire. They just yeah, it comes off in big slabs. Yes, yeah, <laughs> it's yeah. amazing. The trade system is really amazing. You know, mm. like mm. Um, stone from here, you know, might have been traded and because yeah, oh, really? it was quarries. Yes, yes so yeah. um, and Gary Word and other places. So mm. and then you had your other ones probably outside of our area, of course, mm. like to get green stone and which was a very valuable. Yes. Well, we heard we heard about the ring trees. Um, Sean was telling us about the ring trees. We had a look, and they were talking about uh, when a group uh, would come through, and it was a boundary marker or whatever, and they put their gift or whatever in the in the ring. Oh. And so I suppose mm -hmm. those like the green rock would be that sort of thing that they would leave, would it? Like, mm. I guess. So. Yeah. Well, it was a very valuable item, and, you know, and there would have been a lot of diplomatic ties between groups and. Oh, that linking yeah. in, like, yeah. like they say, even language was traded at times, and and obviously yeah. women, yes. and mm. you know, <laughs> yeah. what well, they traded women. Well, there mm. would have been oh, those really? links to to mm. set up a proper marriage because you had to keep marriage in a way that was, um, mm. you know, so people didn't marry in all the time. Yeah. I really appreciate your time, Gail, yeah. and yeah. Honey Nancy. It's yeah. been fantastic. Oh, that was great. And you're still up for this afternoon. Um. Yeah. All yeah. right. Is the Dimble Post Office a good spot to meet up? Yeah, that good. All right. Can you able to tell us uh, the importance of Ebenezer Mission to the people? Well, all, all our families, you know, we've descended from people that lived here. And, um, I mean, my, my family was the Cameron family and um, uh, Pelham and Blanche Cameron, they lived here. And um, it was started in 1859. And, I mean, the Wellers family, the Marxists, it, all, and yeah, the Harrisons. And the Pippers, and Pippers and Kennedy, all. Yeah. yeah. Yep, and, and yeah, so we've, you know, and these are our, the our, our um, African ancestors that all came under the, the um, BGLC claim and um, our evidence was based around our knowledge of what um, we knew about um, here, the mission and where our people came from. This was a ceremonial ground, Punya Bunnett, and, um, you know, Basically, um, a lot of people had to come here to the mission because um, we were driven off um, a lot of the lands in the Wimmera Mallee area, and with the you know the um, frontier situation that happened, and um, you know we're all aware of the uh, massacres, and um, it was pretty sort of hostile time. Yeah. And um, but you know our people survived, and. Um, you know, we were very, you know, they were very strong people, and um, and we're still strong. So, and you know, getting our our connection material together and getting our consent determination has been a really big thing for our people. So, yeah. And Ebenezer is a very special place because of that, and it has a couple of different meanings. Like, um, on one hand, our people weren't really allowed well, to speak our language. What they use in oh, yeah. Right? yeah. Yep. On the market garden, yeah, oh, little, yeah. little people, yeah. little babies, yeah. like a buried area. Yeah. Yep. Oh. yeah, we have it. There's, a, all. there's yeah. um, probably about yeah, 150. It. Well, we, there could be mm. more, couldn't there? Mm. Yeah. And the thing about when Ebenezer, when all that wasn't established, it was all bush. But oh. I can tell you a story when we get inside it that yeah. I tell people. Um, uh, the, they had, right, they had blackfellas, right, the the Wachabalics that they tried to convert to Christianity. Yes. Mm. But then there were those they did not believe, and they were the, still a wild blackfellas, right? Yes. And then one time, um, 
they all wanted to fight. They wanted to kill the missionaries. And they come there and they chanted. And they're chanting and chanting. And they got all the kids, those missionaries, inside that big building. And they sang a hymn. Uh, the old yeah, it was Rock of Ages, Absolutely. and the more they and chanted, the, old toilet. Yeah. the more they sang inside the church, and the louder they got inside the church, and uh, probably with the acoustics there that they mm -hmm. had, because yes, it's really yeah. high when you walk inside, no, your yeah. voice would echo, yeah. and it because we're going to get, and in the end, get they this down their weapons, done up. Okay. And just yes. to Good. In regards to the, the buildings here, I'm just looking at the, the little map here. Yes. Oh, yeah. um, is that the only building that's sort of left at the site, is it? The, yes. the actual church there? So, mm. so that, all that, Yeah. that's what's mm. all left. Mm. This, this would have been the original layout. The so original layout, yeah. Yeah, the so, original. So what buildings are left? Just the oh. church? What you'll see the church is and, and, and inside yeah. we've got the old, the old kitchen. Mm. You know, somewhere between here and Antwerp, or could be that way along the river, it's where, like, uh, my mum, her brothers, a chooking, and our you know great grand people, yeah. they were born. <coughs> they didn't want in, didn't want yeah. um, the missionary wives having anything to do with the birth of their children. Right. So, you know, they used to sneak off down the river, have their babies down there. Those women look after them. My mum was born on the river there. All her brothers were. It's amazing. Mm. I think Ebenezer, uh, is that the last mission standing? Or what about Condo? Is there one at Condo? I think Ebenezer's the best.